Hydrometers, the spirits of Pochi. Hi, hello, I'm Eva, and I'm here to talk about hydrometers. Hydrometers are scientific tools. Hello, to measure everybody. My name is Patricia, and I'm best friend Eva. Eva, help! Well, this will be interesting. Well, going back to the topic, hydrometers are used to measure the specific gravity of a liquid or, in other words, the density of a substance in comparison to water. A hydrometer is a thin glass tube with a latch rod at the bottom to weight it down and make it float upright. Oh boy, that sure sounds like fun! It does! Wait, was that a pop? This tube is placed in a larger graduated cylinder with the liquid that is being tested. Then, the markings of the hydrometer at the top of the liquid determine its specific gravity. Water should always come out to be 1.000, as hydrometer compares to the density of water. So now, what as I perform this experiment? Water? You think when making this? That it won't draw out like you said it would. Hydrometers are based on the law of flotation which states is equal to the weight of the fluid it displaces. Sadly, Archimedes will stay out of this thing because he focuses on uptrust and not the liquid displaced. Sorry, dude. Well, basically the hydrometer dips into the liquid in a graduated cylinder and it sinks. The deeper it sinks, the more liquid it displaces. Therefore, we can measure the density of that liquid. The deeper it goes, the less dense is the liquid. The higher it goes, the more dense the liquid is. You have to be dense to not understand this. Wow. Just wow. And now, the fun part that the title of this project foreshadows. There is a number of uses for hydrometers, but it has one purpose that everyone will remember it for. Brewing pochi. Basically, pochi is homemade beer. So the only popular use for hydrometers is brewing beer. I mean, okay, to each their own, but that's the only thing it's good for. Seems like you can beer that. Are you being serious? Well, I could say something on how it is used for checking the alcohol content in Pochin, but then the presentation would go like this. Why are you making this project on alcohol? Oh, but making Pochin is legal in Ireland since 1997, which means that it is not wrong to talk about this topic. Yes, but it is a class full of underage people. And you have a video talking about making beer. Oh. So, just a quick explanation so that the cops, or teacher, can't catch me. There's a third setting on the hydrometer that shows the content of potential alcohol in beer. You measure it when the room is like 16 degrees Celsius, so after putting in sugar as the alcohol content will be the highest at this point. Then you wait a couple of weeks so that the beer will ferment as it will have a smaller alcohol reading. Collect that reading, subtract the original by fermenting, multiply by 105, then multiply by 1.25, and this is the percentage of alcohol in the given beer sample. I taught you a thing now. This is an example of a home use of a hydrometer. And now, please say that you remember something from what I said. I'm not repeating myself. Nah, you brought us a perfect explanation. Oh, for God. So, hydrometers. You use them to measure the density of a liquid. It is based on the law of flotation and is commonly used in brewing beer or wine. So this only need to know, the internet will fill in the rest. Or me. Just now. What are Fs? And now, does my guest have anything fun to say for the ending? You're alphabet. Good night. Thank you.